what's up. So tomorrow will mark the day that James Byrd Jr.'s killer, John William King, will be executed in Texas. And in case y'all don't remember, James Byrd was an African-American man that was dragged to the back of a car in Texas by a lynching. And this was a racist killing act in Texas. And as someone who used to live in Texas, I know how them good old boys get down. And this was the funny, the trip off thing about it is, is that uh, Bush, the one who stole the, the, the election from Al Gore, was governor at the time. They did not push this as a hate crime per se, even though it was. You know, a lot of people don't, you know, a lot of people look at Dennis Rodman and you can think what you want to think of him as a colorful character and whatnot. But Dennis Rodman, DR, went there and paid for the services for James Byrd Jr. service. And that wasn't talked about near enough. But this man was dragged. No different than a slave, you know, just dragged on the back. And these guys, one of the guys got license, but this one guy, he's getting executed tomorrow. And they all should be executed. You know, because people don't understand what goes on with this, uh, you know, what goes on with this racism. And this this is this lynching. This happened in 97. This wasn't that long ago. You know, because people like, always like to act like you talking, you know, 70 to 100 years ago, which wasn't that long ago either. But this was fresh. And I remember when James Byrd Jr. was dragged and killed. And he, and he didn't deserve that. And this racism is real. Um, this was perpetrated on Strictly Hate. And um, they need to fry them turkeys. All of them need to be fried for that mess. Because, you know, you sitting up there just gonna because you don't like some because of color of their skin and in your, in your area. And you think that you can run roughshod? That's just not even cool. Not even at all. So, John William King is that biggest name. So, fry that turkey. That's what I say. James Byrd Jr. was a cool cat. He didn't deserve that. And all, but we we always see this thing regurgitating itself. It's no different than Rodney King getting beat up by them racist cops in L.A. So the same thing with these white racist dudes dragging people. And until people really make a change about some stuff, these behaviors continue to happen. Remember, I'm talking about something that happened a little over 20 years ago. I ain't say 200 years ago. I didn't say a hundred years ago. I said twenty. These things happen. History does repeat itself. Racism ain't going nowhere. And um, but James Byrd Jr. is gonna get some justice. They're gonna fry this turkey for for that. And I mean, even for Texas, that's a milestone because the fact that they would hold uh, somebody white accountable for their racism that's a pretty powerful statement. So that's my take. James Byrd Jr.'s killer is gonna get fried tomorrow. Executed. For the killing, racist killing, John William King. Feel free to leave them comments, hit that subscribe button, and when the bell rings, that's a new video. I'm out. Peace.